My wife and I made all sorts of promises to ourselves that on my year off we were going to, oh, we're going to go to the theatres and galleries and do all this stuff. Uh, we didn't. We watched the telly. <laughs> we like a bit of telly indoors. We're not ashamed of it. People are pompous and they go, oh, I haven't got a TV. I always go, no, I ain't got any books. <laughs> yeah, about that, all those words and ideas strung together to create stories and theories. Fuck <laughs> that for a lot. Put the telly on. We've got three levels of viewing in our house. We've got a family viewing, Bake Off, X Factor, that sort of stuff. There's my stuff, which I shall be watching later, once she's gone to bed. All the quality gear, sex, etc. cetera. <laughs> Parking wars. Can't pay, we'll take it away. Oy, oy. <laughs> Anything where it might kick off. And then we've got what we call our shows. They're few and far between. These are shows that my wife and I can enjoy as a couple. They come up very, very rarely. And if me and my wife see one, I say, babe, our show, our show. And she goes, yeah, our show, our show. And we give each other a high five and we agree we're gonna watch this show as a couple, never individually. This is a lovely agreement to make, but it does mean that it can be years before I get through a box set. Because <laughs> she goes to bed at half eight. <laughs> she stands up in the middle of an episode. I've got to go to bed, babe. I'm absolutely shattered, she says. Absolutely shattered. Now, you younger men have probably got girlfriends who will stay up quite late, 11 o'clock, things like that, you know, like three episodes. You're going to get married and have children. She's going to go back to work. You're going to get a lot of this. About half eight, you get, oh, I've got to go to bed, babe. I'm absolutely shattered. You must never say at that point, why is that then? <laughs> why are you so tired, babe? You have to go, oh, I can imagine, babe. Oh, the day you've had, eh? You had let the gardeners in, didn't you? <laughs> Put that Ocado delivery away. Show the cleaner where she's going wrong. I'll bet you're in bits, babe. <laughs>